Hello everyone, my name's Mispa. Welcome back to another video. So in the first part of the video, I'm going to recite Sonnet 98 by William Shakespeare. And I'm going to show you some beautiful images of April and the flowers in bloom. And the reason why I love this sonnet is because it's about a, a poet missing someone that he is in love with and he can't be with them. And because he's absent from them in the spring, he can't enjoy the natural beauty around him. And even though the world is so joyful and the flowers are so blooming that even the Roman god Saturn, that would normally be melancholic and very sad, is actually doing somersaults with joy because of so much beauty around him. But the poet, um, he may as well be in winter time because to him, all these flowers and their colours, everything seems false and he can't enjoy them. To him, they are imitations of the person um, that he would rather be with. And it makes me think of times when we've been at a party or we've been at an occasion where there's happiness around us, but we've had our own personal uh, problems or our own personal um, sadness and we sit there quite feeling quite depressed because you know we can't join in with the happiness there and so it reminds me of those times. I think it's a very beautiful sonnet and I hope you'll enjoy it and then I'll see you after that. Sonnet 98 by William Shakespeare From you have I been absent in the spring when proud-pied April, dressed in all his trim, hath put a spirit of youth in everything, that heavy Saturn laughed and leapt with him. Yet nor the lays of birds, nor the sweet smell of different flowers in odour and in hue, could make me any summer story tell, or from their proud lap pluck them where they grew. Nor did I wonder at the lily's white, nor praise the deep vermilion in the rose. They were but sweet, but figures of delight drawn after you, you pattern of all those. Yet seemed it winter still, and you away. As with your shadow, I with these did play. Welcome back. So now I'm going to share with you a visit I made to a town called Bakewell. It's a market town in Derbyshire. So it's near the Peak District. It's situated on the River Wye and it's really relaxing to walk along the river when it's a beautiful spring day. I love the um, buildings made out of this honey coloured stone and the cottages have these courtyards and the whole town has quite a relaxing feel. It's famous for a pudding called Bakewell Tart, which legend has it that it was made uh, by mistake when a cook uh, made a mistake with one of her puddings and it's now world famous. Uh, one of the reasons why I like to visit it is because Apparently, Jane Austen based the town uh, Lambton in Pride and Prejudice on Bakewell. And so I like to think of this um, link with one of my favourite novels. And I like to think of Jane Austen visiting uh, Bakewell and using it um, for inspiration in her book. So I hope you enjoy that second part of the video. Hope you find it interesting. Thank you for watching. See you next time.